See the females, look at that. As the females stop, the youngsters stop. And then they move again. <laughs> See, they want to bond a bit. The females are still in a potential hunting mood. They're a bit lean. It looks like they haven't eaten for a few days. So they're paying a bit more attention. The young ones are more like the night's over and they know that they're going to settle down soon. So they're a bit more interested in play. Look at that. Beautiful. It's now Tuma Fuzzies and Tuma Pimpons. They just crossing Junction Philemon's Cutline Weaver's Nest down to the Scorbunny. Okay, okay, yeah. There's another youngster coming out as well on the right. This female deciding to go down towards the drainage line again. Just going to see what the other one does. <coughs> Very often. Very, very often these lines will just use the road systems. Nice and quiet to walk on, it gives them a slight advantage. So it might be that other female is just going down to the drainage line a bit to see if there's anything in there. Patience of the youth, youth being improved here. Yeah, they're waiting and staying behind the adults. down the end there from Juma, he's turning around. <clears throat> Look at that, the two youngsters stalking mum. Love this practice. Oh, All practicing. This is how one day they would grab a zebra or a buffalo. So a lot of fun and play and socializing, but it's got its practical purposes as well. Aubrey, just for update, these Gala moving on Weaver's Nest Road now, away from Philemon's Dip.
definitely still want to hunt these guys. Are, like I said, a bit hungry. Looking at their condition, they could go for another five, six days without any problems not eating, but then they will start losing condition quite rapidly. So they'd be wanting to eat in the next two days or so, definitely. Now, as soon as the sun comes up and the day gets brighter, the odds go down. It's not impossible for them to catch something now. If they get a good opportunity, maybe something that's totally unaware of them or something, they could, they could catch it. But their odds are much better at night. So I wouldn't say they're going to try too long. Maybe another 20 minutes, half an hour or so that they'll be doing this, looking around, sniffing around. If opportunity presents, they'll go for it. But it's going to be more energy efficient for them to just relax for the day and try again tonight. Youngster still, they're going to probably get up just now, I presume. Let's just go a bit closer. <laughs> Always enough energy for play to a young animal. Yeah, just these in Gala, they're now going towards the deep Skovanin. Um But I'll try and stick with them as long as I can. This is the first time I had opportunity to really have a close look at these cubs. Both of them are females. So that means they'll remain with this pride possibly for quite a while. And now they're going where the going gets stuck. Right into the drainage line there. Look at that. 